David, a really great victory for you today. 32 points now in 19 matches. You're up to seventh. That unbeaten run of six games continues. And that word we talked about before, momentum, consistency as well that you're looking mm -hmm. for in this team. You've got that in abundance now. We certainly have, and uh, we needed it tonight. Uh, it wasn't our best performance, but uh, as you really said, it keeps a, a small run going at the moment. We're showing a bit of growth at the whole club. We're growing in how we play and what we do. I'd have liked to have played better tonight, but... Uh, but I'm not disappointed with, with taking three points, that's for sure. Well, you've been talking about a new West Ham this season. Mikel Antonio was talking to us before. He said that you haven't even reached top gear, as you say. You're not playing at your best, but the chemistry is so right in the club. How far can you dream this season? Because in a season like no other, anything can happen. Well, I'd like to really dream a lot, but we're also very humble and we, we understand that certainly at West Ham, we're not going to start shouting about things too soon because... Uh, History has shown that sometimes we don't always uh, are able to back that up. I want to be the one who can back it up and I want to be the one who, who does make things look better. And uh, so I'm going step by step. We're making progress. We're, we're picking up some good points. You know, for us to get to this po levels of points at this time in the season is very good. But I don't, I don't see that being where I want to be or where I want the players to be. I want us to be competing at the top end. So if we have to, do, we have to do that, then we're going to have to keep winning. And sometimes you have to win a little bit ugly. I mean, tonight I thought we won a little bit ugly, but but we got there. Well, Mikel Antonio keeps producing the goods. He's one of those quality players, a real servant for this club. But I know you're always wary of playing him too much after returning from injury. How important will it be to dip into this transfer market and have some backup for him? Uh, it, it would be important if the right ones were there, but it's only important if if the players are available and the ones we want. But. Uh, you know, we don't want to we don't want to go and bring people in here who we, we regret doing and, and doesn't help the team. So we'll we'll try and get somebody. If we don't then we'll we'll find solutions within the squad if we can. Is anyone on the radar? Not at the moment, no.